Hello everyone, this is Mike and this is number 18 in the SDR Uno series of videos. In this video I'm going to try my best to explain why I always say give yourself some separation between the tune and the LO. Uh, the LO is the RSP's oscillator and the tune is the software oscillator within SDR Uno. So I'm going to launch SDR Uno. I'm not going to give myself any separation between the tune and the LO. And you'll see that there is a, a spike, it's called a DC spike and it's in the center of the of the band. So we're at two megahertz of IF bandwidth. And dead center here is gonna be a spike. And there's a DC uh, compression algorithm that will remove that spike. And if you tune a station where the, where the LO is, it's going to sound muffled. It's not gonna demodulate properly. So let's, let's do that. Okay. You you can't even see the carrier here, the, the top of the the top of the carrier. Because it's being compressed through the algorithm. So let's tune off a little. And now we have some separation and it demodulates properly. Okay, now let's discuss the LO lock. Locking uh, the LO. Locking the LO is this way you don't tune outside of the IF bandwidth selected. So if we're using two megahertz of bandwidth and I lock the LO, I'm not gonna go below 12.900 or above 14.700. It locks the LO in place to the IF bandwidth selected. So this is locked. and I can't go any further down and I can't go any further up now I use this when I am working a, a single band let's say 20 meters and I want to stay within uh, let's say 2 megahertz of bandwidth so I would I would go to 14 225 to 14 350 and I'm, I'm always going to be within that that range the range of the IF bandwidth so if I needed a, a greater IF bandwidth, I would just select it here, uh, four, megahertz, uh, 4 megahertz or 5, uh, 8, whatever the amount that you need. That is why I lock the LO, and that is why you always give yourself separation between the tune and the LO, because there is a DC compression algorithm taking place where the LO is, and it will not demodulate uh, the stations properly. And that's basically it. I, I hope this explains why I use the yellow lock and uh, helps explain why I always say give yourself separation between the two and the yellow. Thank you guys so much for watching. Any comments, uh, please leave them. And I'll see you guys in the next video.